Hey guys and welcome to Remnant 2. Today we are doing a very mean duo joined by me mate Liam. On top of this we are going to be tackling a very tricky boss fight and more shooting along the way. So if that sounds good to you, stay tuned and enjoy the video. Yeah, no. Clementine going off up there right now, not gonna lie. Oh, he wants me, Liam, he wants me. <laughs> Oh, he can have you, I don't want to fuck with that. <laughs> Please leave me alone. Oh, he turned around. No. Fuck off! There we go. There we are. And I forgot he does it after he dies. What a prick. If you guys want to, like, find out how to get the Enigma, um, I'll do a video on that as well. So if you're doing a duo like we are, you both have an yeah, enigma. Yeah, it is one, scary. Nah, maybe a door maybe, I bet we can't open. Yeah, I was just about to say that. Maybe we can't open it. Ah, we should have. Oh, there we go. Checked first. Yes, <laughs> oh, fuck! Oh, never mind! See what happens when you knock, James? Deathless, interloper. Okay. Easy now. And where it stands, it dies. Well, maybe we can talk about this. Dafka. Oh. <sighs> it seems it shall live for now. But tell us, Paxeltek, what woes does it bring this time? Is that a deer? Yeah. Are those a wait, are they? No, wait, those are red. Fuck. What are they gonna do? Run us over? I don't know, but it had a red thing, so I shot it. You, shoot it. you bloody yeah. you, the mate. What did it do Look, to you? It, it was red. I don't know. Maybe it's gonna turn to like a big worm and eat me. I don't know. It just <laughs> it wasn't green, so I figured better kill it. Not to be fair, this game does do that to you. I'm not trying to get jump scared by a, a deer that turns into a giant, like, organ-eating worm. No, just not my cup of tea. Oh, Jesus! <laughs> yeah, he's probably <laughs> trying to jump scare you. Okay. Oh, I just learned something new. If you uh, aim and press shift, you can change, um, you, like, which, which shoulder Oh, yeah, your, your shoulder, yeah. I don't think I'll ever use that, but it's good to know it's there. <laughs> hey, Liam. Oh, it's an amulet. You oh, no. No, 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 no. The man. You suck, dude. Oh, you're not breathing oh. again. What's this guy? Liam, Liam, Liam. Whoa! <laughs> I'll help him. Oh, he teleported. That oh, makes my head. What was that dude? I ain't got a clue, but he was not in a good mood. Something crazy looking. I feel like I it's gonna doubt. be like Grim Reaper, dude. That looks like someone, like a person. Dude. <laughs> What is that? That ain't a person, bro. That's like a whoa. Is he gonna suck you in? He's opened a portal to the nether realm. What the hell? <laughs> I I still don't even really understand what he is. Oh no. <laughs> Oh, I've got root rot. Oh god, I've got root rot. I'm down. I'm down. 
I'm dead. Oh, bro. you're dead too? <laughs> okay. I have a plan. Um, I'm going to use my orb ability and uh, through that, you should take some damage. Yeah, that's doing nice. That's doing very good job. Look at that limb. Yeah, that is doing a lot more. Oh god. Having to get close to this guy for me to do damage to him is really hurting me, man. Dude, we're already right on the second time. Base. Um, I can heal you. Um, I'm coming to you, dude. Yeah, yeah. Try, try use it in here, just so we're out of the lab. And... Ah, uh, damn it! It happened again. Oh, and I'm gonna get root rot again, bro. Watch out. Can you use it? Oh, lucky I put this here. I did not budge that. Okay, watch out, dude. I'm trying. Just waiting for that like, jump, dude. Man. Sorry. That's super, dude. Alright. I might die, I'm gonna be honest. Uh, Alright, I'll come to you. I'll come to you. Oh. Yep, I died. God damn it, man. Oh, I can't. And do anything from down. I have to get close to him. Whenever I get close to him, he fucks me up. Thank you. Oh, that is not good. I'm dead, bro. I can't. I can't. I'm so useless in this boss fight, I can't go close to him without dying, and I can't do anything without going close to him. Yeah, that's right. Oh. I think I've got Root Rod now as well, which is really annoying. Here, dude. You're stronger than me. Dodge, dodge, dodge. That does remind me, I've not tried to use this thing on him yet, I think going to. Just healing up. Alright. Yeah, Jump! Where is he? Where is he? Uh, where is he? Oh yeah, this actually does do a lot more damage to him oh, than I gave it credit for. We're doing good, man. We're doing good. Yeah, the old thing on the Enigma actually hurts him so much. It hurts it hurts him so much. He's actually getting fucked right now. I'm going in for the killing blow. Come on, there we go! Yes! Let's go! Good stuff. <laughs> that is like Wow. You need this that gun, was guys. Annoying. Yeah. Tell them, Liam, we should do a tutorial on how to get this gun. It is very broken. Yeah, that yes. that old thing, this thing here, this was doing a number on him. That's not a tree. The lady dude, of the tree, bro. <laughs> yeah. Mother Nature. <laughs> no, not Mother Nature. What summons me from my ethereal wanderings? A powerful god conscripts you into their service and offers you a choice. You may rule the underworld and never return to the living, or you may serve at the god's pleasure in the mortal realm. Serve above or rule below. What say you, sweet beast? What do you reckon, James? Serve above or rule below? Hear this, Liam, right? Right? I'm not going to get into politics here, but Tony oh, Abbott... Oh, God, here we go. <laughs> no, not my, not my man, Tony Abbott. <laughs> well, here's the way I look at this one, right? All right, what do you think? In my in, in my current state, right, yeah. as I am now, return that money every day of the week. 
But okay. if I'm put into the shoes of a poor family that's starving and a bunch of money falls off a car, you best believe I'm taking that fucking money. <laughs> you spin <laughs> no, my no, no, no. Right round, right. Your son is tied to the track of a minecart and will surely die unless you pull a switch to save him. However, he pleads with you not to pull the switch for his daughter, your granddaughter, is tied to the other track. Do you save your son? Or your granddaughter. See, now this is a very. Have you have you heard of this? Um, I, I forgot what it's called. It's like there's like a name for it, but it's like the. I'll just call it like the railway dilemma for the sake of it. But it's that thing where it's like there's a train uh, hurtling down the tracks towards one person, right? Yeah. And you can pull the lever to save that person, but in doing so, it'll move it to a track that has four people tied to it. Yeah. And so the whole the whole dilemma is like, do you leave it and not save someone? Uh, so essentially do nothing and someone dies because you do nothing. Or do you do something and save someone, but at the expense of four other people? You know what I mean? Have you heard of that? Like sort of, you can look it up. There's like heaps of things on it. Because it's like a, I don't know what they use it for, but it's like, um, it's a big question. And I've always been of the opinion that, I mean, obviously the way it's described in this game is a bit different because it's just one for one, but I've always been of the opinion to just don't pull the lever. <laughs> in this scenario, the lever is definitely a no-go. Yeah, so we're going to have to save the granddaughter. Because although you're right, the son can reproduce. If we pull the lever, we are directly killing a granddaughter, <laughs> as opposed to to doing nothing here. So we'll and and right. that end of the son is pleading to save the granddaughter as well. So just he he wants us to also not touch the lever. What a cool guy! So we'll we'll go with the well granddaughter done. here. You are a key witness in the trial of a thief. The thief stole money from a market but then donated all of the stolen coin to a neglected orphanage. Telling the truth, even the whole truth, will end with the thief in jail and the stolen coin returned to its proper owners. Do you report the thief or allow the poor orphans to keep the coin? Because it puts you in like a weird spot because... That's correct. Yeah, it's just... It's like... It's a... I'd probably let the orphans have the money. Uh, so sh we really should just let them have it, shouldn't we? <laughs> yes. <laughs> I rate that. The orphans should have the money. Oh, dear. <clears throat> no bother. It's nothing. Moving on. Oh, God. She didn't seem too happy with that one. A determined warlord is about to set fire to a crowded cigarette. You have his eldest son in your custody. You could stop the warlord by hurting his son breaking his arm and threatening to do worse unless the warlord relents and gives himself up. Do you torture your hostage or let the crowd fend for itself in the fire? Well, look, um, I'm not pointing fingers, but uh, military torture all the time to get answers and I don't see why it's wrong to, to prevent something happening if you can. That is true. So we think and break his arm. <laughs> I'm thinking snap his neck, mate. <laughs> okay, well, we're not quite doing that, but we will break his arm. You have chosen your path, sweet beast. I'm concerned. Your heart is true. That's good. May the power of the doe's eye free you from your incarnate shackles. Is that a good thing? Yes. Received an oh, alignment. Re oh, so there wasn't really a wrong way to go about that. So basically, dependent on the answers we gave her, she gave us a trait. Oh, okay. Yep, fair enough. I'm, I'm intrigued to read what trait we got, but I want to finish this conversation with her. Oh.